Okay, guys, welcome to Momentos de Tecnología, our Spanish channel in which you can also find a lot of information in English for all those moments of technology. In this opportunity, we're going to find uh, a way, two different ways of restoring to default the access points from Unify. Okay, in this case, we're going to find uh, at the bottom of the device um, a very small hole where you can uh, insert a clip and you can have it pressed for about 10 seconds. Remember that uh, in this way you're going to see uh, both lights coming on and then after a few seconds they are going to be turned off. You wait about uh, four or five more seconds and your device will be rebooting with the default configuration. This one is the easiest way of restoring these devices but remember that sometimes we have these devices up in the ceiling or uh, some places that are very difficult to reach so we recommend this way in order to change controller or just uh, reconfigure all your network. Let's take a look at the other option that we have for these devices. Okay, we're going to download the Putty uh, as Secure Shell uh, connection program that you can download from that's putty.org. We're going to connect to the IP address of the device and remember that you have to log in with the username and the password that you use uh, from the um, from the controller in this case I'm going to use admin and 12345 as the password you copy the following command and you're going to be able to reset your device to the default settings you just type uh, right click paste it and that's it you're good to go press enter and in a few seconds you're going to see that the connection is lost this is due to the to the connection being closed by the device being rebooted as you can see here in a few moments you will be able to see the device ready for adoption here we're going to click here and adopt and you're going to see in a few seconds that the device has already the blue light on let's check it out this is the device you can see that it is already provisioning the network status and the network characteristics okay guys thank you for watching remember that we have a lot of other videos that are very interesting and see you next time